In this video, I'm going to show you how to apply a broadcast safe filter to your project in Final Cut Pro X. So the first thing I'm going to do is duplicate the project by clicking on it and hitting Command D. And then we'll rename it. And load it into the timeline by double clicking it. Now we'll bring up our video scopes. So over in the right hand corner, we have a drop down menu and you can choose show video scopes. We go over to our settings in video scopes and you want to make sure that you have waveform, luma, and IRE selected. Now we can analyze the footage by dragging through. And you can see on the scope how it's going over 100 and below zero, which is out of legal limits for broadcast. OK, to fix this, first we're going to make a compound clip so we can apply the filter to the entire project. So what we're going to do is hit Command A on the keyboard to select all of the clips. Go up to File, New, Compound Clip. And you can hit OK. OK, now you should have a single track on your timeline. So to apply the filter, we're going to come over here to the Effects Browser. Open that up. And in the search bar, let's type in broadcast. And that should bring up your broadcast safe filter. So let's drag that right to our timeline. And there you go. All of your clips should now be within legal broadcast limits. And we can see the before and after by opening up the inspector window here and clicking on and off the filter.